Minister of Petroleum has now charged women in energy, oil and gas to work towards the growth of the industry. The Minister of State for Petroleum challenged women to play the role in ensuring that Nigeria becomes an energy sufficient nation. Helen Osamide Akins has details and will return with business news. Women in Energy, Oil and Gas is a forum created to promote gender diversity and inclusion in the male dominated sector. It is aimed at creating opportunities for women to step into leadership roles and pursue their career, business, and personal goals in line with the Global Goal 5. With the month of March dedicated to celebrate women, the women in this sector are not left out. As they commemorate the International Women's Day, the men in the industry challenge them to bring in their specialty as women to help grow the industry, even as they pledge support for them. There's no country in the world that has oil and gas that gives priority to any other sector, gives premium or priority attention to oil and gas. And since you women, you have a special gift from God to do it better than men, I believe that we've been able to identify the solution to our problems to oil and gas. And we will sustain that support that you need to be able to survive in this industry. And today, I've uh, discovered them and we are going to make good use of them to bridge the gap so that we will move from energy poverty to energy security. And I believe with their support, we will achieve that. Other speakers believe that the inclusion of women in the industry will foster the needed growth in the sector. Women in energy have consistently been breaking barriers, making significant contributions, and doing positive change in various aspects of the oil and gas industry. A singular objective to close the energy gaps. This energy gaps have three main branches. The gender gap in the industry, the energy poverty gap in the industry. The event honored individuals who have contributed to the development of women in the sector. Helen Osamedeik.